Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about the roles in Power BI service. So let's get started. Now what I mean by roles in Power BI service is basically giving permissions a certain permissions to the users to whom I have shared my reports or with whom I have shared the workspace. Okay, so that is what roles are all about. Now, there are four types of roles in Power BI. Okay, one is your admin. The other one is member. Then you have the contributor role and then you have a viewer role. Okay, so these are the four types of role that is associated in Power BI and you can assign these roles to a workspace or to the reports that you have created. Okay, now let us go and see what all access to this particular members or admin have okay so to view that let us go to the microsoft document and see what are the roles okay so i am into the uh, document the microsoft document and you can see the workspace rules which says admin members contributor and viewer so what all access admin is having is update and delete the workspace so an admin will go ahead and create a workspace he can delete that workspace as well but the other three roles do not have that permission okay admin can add or remove people including the other admins okay and allow contributors to update the app for the workspace so admin is having an upper hand as compared to the member access or member role member is having upper hand as compared to the contributor role and contributor is having an upper hand as compared to viewer role okay so a viewer can only view and interact with an item that is your workspace or the report that you have given access to okay now a viewer can only read data that is stored in a workspace data flow he won't be able to make any changes to to the workspace or to the reports or to the data set that is he can only read or the viewer will only have a read access and not the right access to any of the workspace or to the reports or to the data sets okay contributor on the other hand will have an access he can go ahead and you know edit or delete a content in a report or in a workspace Okay, he can publish a report to the work a workspace and delete the content as well, the contributor and the member as well. On the other hand, a member can allow other user to share the reports that has been created or kept in a workspace. Okay, a member can manage a semantic model permissions and all. So, you know, you can go to the uh, learning.microsoft.com and go and see what all access to uh, admin member and contributor have okay so this is the list of the uh, access that all the four roles is associated in power bi service okay so now let us go to the power bi service and see how we can assign this roles to a workspace or to a report that is create so i am into power bi service and now let us see how we can assign some roles so to do so what i'll do is i'll go to the workspace now i want to go and assign a workspace role to another user so to do so, I will have to go and click on this more option and you see an option which says workspace access. Once I click this, it will ask me to add people or groups. I have to click on add people and group. Here, you can add the name of a person or an email ID from your organization. And here you have the option which says whether you want to add this as an admin member contributor or viewer okay so i do not have any associated people for now so what i'll do is i will just try to assign it to myself okay so i'll just click and i will just click and say i want this to be a viewer role and i will just click on add okay i'm not able to do it so because as of now i am the only admin for this particular workspace so i won't be able to do it now let me check if i am able to add as add me as a member 
I'm not able to because this button is grayed out. So I'm not able to. If I want to add other people, I can do it by just clicking on add. Okay. Similarly, if you have created any reports, you can just go to the option. You can follow the same step and you will be able to add other people to your report as well. Okay. So yes, that's all about in today's video. Hope you like this video. Please comment below and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day.